Well, a blast from the past, Twisters. I am excited. Hello, what's going on, everybody? I'm Jabby Koe, joined by Achara Kirk. What's up? And we've got the twist. Wow, words, Jabby. Take a breath. The Tisters. The Titsters. The Twisters trailer in front of us. Uh, I loved Twister as a kid, and it's been many years since I've watched it. I'm excited to see a cow being flung around a truck. Oh my god, um, yes. If you guys haven't done so already, hit the subscribe button, please bell icon, all notifications, pretty please vote this up, let YouTube know you're enjoying what you're watching. Let's twist right into this, here we go. Ooh. Oh. oh, right into it. Guys, whatever's in there, it's big and it's moving fast. Drive, go, 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 go. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, no shit. Oh, wow. Oh, the OG font. It's Tyler Owens. He calls himself Tornado Wrangler. If you feel it, chase it! I said if you feel it, chase it! Oh, she's perfect! She's gorgeous! You thought you could destroy a tornado. You never had a chance. You want one? What? What? <laughs> oh, no. God, <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> Whoa. You ride him. You're crazy. We got twins! Twins! <laughs> oh no. Okay, that's why it's called Twisters. Nope. My. Wow. Oh. Wow. Okay. I think that they should have given us this trailer in 4K because the H.264 or whatever they, uh, the codec they used, it couldn't keep up with it. And I don't think it did the trailer justice. It might be one of those things where you just have to watch it in theaters to truly appreciate it. But nonetheless, it looks exciting to me. I mean, just seeing the scope of it and what they're going to do, it's definitely a callback to the original with the little thingies that are used to... I mean, in the original, it was used to measure the twisters. I don't know what exactly they're doing here. He said something about destroying a, a, a tornado. Well, okay, so here's... I thought maybe she wanted to destroy one, and then he was like, oh, or we can make one. Let's make one. And then I thought that maybe they were man-made tornadoes, and then they accidentally made two. Am I crazy? I don't think that's what happened. Oh, okay. Well, you know, that was the story that I had in my head. <laughs> I don't think that's what happened. Oh, <laughs> I, shit. I'm pretty sure that's not what happened. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but uh, maybe I'm wrong. Uh, no, I, I think that they just happened to see, you know, like a double rainbow. They just happened to see two twisters, like two twisters. in the wild. Yeah. I know. It's gross. That's the thing that's happened. Yeah. <laughs> that's the thing that happens, I'm sure. And like, but it's a fun idea to see these, you know, a bunch of yahoos, the cowboys, going out there and chasing down, you know, nature things that you should avoid at all costs. Are we getting a, a comeback of natural disaster movies now? Because they were really big in the 90s for a while. I don't think they've ever gone away. Okay. Never yeah, mind. I think that it's just we don't we're not paying as much attention to them. Although definitely the fact that it is, you know, Twister is a sequel to Twister, which was you know, a fun movie that I watched when I was a, a kid. I'm like, oh, yeah, that, that could be interesting. Also, you know, we've got Glenn Powell, who's in a lot of things now. So, yeah, um, well, he's in Top Gun. Right? Yeah. And so he did this rom-com with Sydney Sweeney as well. And uh, the, there was an interesting moment in the tr in the somewhere in the trailer where you, the camera was like inside the truck and it almost felt like a GoPro or something. It's just something creative that I noticed. And I'm like, I guess it's to make it feel more real. Like yeah. part of part of what's going on there. You yeah. Know what I mean? No, I'm interested to see like what upgrades to the first film they can make with it, you know, 
been what like 30 years or so since the original i can't remember when twister came out and so you know technology filmmaking has come quite a ways since then so it's like okay there was a sense of it feeling quite similar like there was a sense of nostalgia even with the way things looked but then also like just amping it up even more like taking it to another extreme with the the look of it and then also with the fact that we don't have just one we've got two they're sister twisters i don't know why they didn't use that line in the movie like mm. that's a genius line but yeah the way the trailer itself was edited was kind of interesting it, it wasn't like i don't know it, it didn't seem to have a, a rhythm to it that was recognizable you know what i mean um, okay. as, as a way of, as a means of kind of building you into this, it just sort of like throws everything at you and it's yeah. just like, it just felt like a, uh, uh, a confetti of stuff. Of stuff, of, of like just tornadoes. Yeah. It was like, you're in a tornado. We're going to make you feel like you're in a tornado and yeah. it's a tornado of a trailer. <laughs> so basically that's, that's an apt <laughs> and astute observation. Because we start right in it. Like the yeah. very first frame was like, we're in it, you know, but yeah. you definitely do get the sense of, of urgency and just how scary it is to to be in the midst of that but also just the craziness of these characters who are hardcore you know tornado fanatics i'll yeah. never understand it because i want to be safe it's only a trailer and it's two minutes long i didn't necessarily feel like excited by the characters per se um i'm more excited at just the premise of going back to this more yeah. than anything that's what's carrying me like would you buy a ticket to go watch it at the theater. Yes. Okay. Yes. So it, it's compelled you enough to be like, oh, I want to go see this. But I would have done that without screen. the trailer. Like off of the name alone, I would have gone to watch it. Got it. You know, but okay. that's me as someone who's familiar with that. Um, but like nothing in here so far. Like if I wasn't familiar with Twister already, I don't know that this would have done it for me. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's only because of the nostalgia. I'm like, yo, I'm, I'm already signed up. Yeah. I, I honestly, uh, after looking at that, I'm like, ah, I could wait for it to come on streaming I'd, i could wait i think that but see i think part of part of that is just the compression like i don't know why it looks like that it just didn't look good it's it was so pixelated and i'm like this is the, it's it's the frustrating thing about youtube and compression in h264 which is a codec used for compression h265 is supposed to be better at handling stuff i don't know if youtube's updated i upload stuff in h265 sometimes as a technical nerdy shit most people don't care about but i feel like there is a way to do things where it if you upload in 4k that already gets you halfway there because youtube is less likely to do compression on your video when you do it in 4k Right. And so, but right. not everybody has access to 4K because I think YouTube made that a premium thing. Something's got to be done, but this <laughs> it's not right. YouTube, stop gatekeeping 4K so like everyone can get it, please. But it's not even like... I know, they made the choice to not put it in 4K, which is weird, not, I feel not, like. Not just that, but there's no 1080 like premium. Premium, yeah. So I don't know like what's going on. Maybe Universal needs to compress it differently. <laughs> Maybe Universal was just like, you know what? I think we know who's going to watch this, the people who are nostalgic for the first film. But I would imagine that if you watch this trailer in theaters, it's going to be so much more thrilling. You know, you're not going to get any of that artifacting going on. Potentially, yeah. So enough about that. Thanks so much, you guys. I'm Jabby Kuwait. This is Achara Kirk. Peace out.